Hi, welcome back to the channel. Today is a request and it's to get Alan to follow the acupressure stick massage. So instead of me doing it on him, he's going to follow the video that we did and he's going to do it on me. As you can imagine, I'm looking forward to seeing how this goes. Let's get started. So all you need for an acupressure stick massage is the acupressure stick in your massage medium. So this is the stick and you can look at previous videos if you want to see exactly how to use them, but they're very simple. And then this is our massage medium and it's one of the Lush massage bars. So instead of using something like an oil or a cream, this will become an oil, but Alan's going to warm up in his hands first and that's how we'll do it. So you are now going to turn on the video. So he's using it on his phone, but we'll put picture in picture here. Alan is here. Hello. Hello. <laughs> right, so you can either warm it in your hands or you could you could actually just take it in your hand and you could massage my arm with it if you want. What would you rather do? I'll just do it like that. Do it like that, right, okay. So the idea is that you're effleuraging and warming up the area. So he's taking the massage medium, which is the bar and... He's now, now I would actually stop the video if I was you because we were chatting away there that's and okay. we've already moved forward. <laughs> He's basically said that's okay, which is code for no. Right, so you are listening off that area and <laughs> I'm laughing because it's actually quite relaxing but it's at like times 20. <laughs> so you're stretching out all the fingers stretching out the palm of the hand and you're using your thumbs to do that and then we start working our way up the arm so oh look at my hand <laughs> turning it round working on the wrist so I'd say he's doing a really good job and that feels nice just feels fast but what do I know let the boss continue Stretching out the fingers. And again, this is just warming up all the area, warming up the tissues. Yeah, see, professional, you can see a bit of fluff there and you're moving it. And then what you're doing is you're starting the process of almost like the hand reflexology. So you're working your way up and down the fingers. So I would say you're actually sort of moving up the edges and down the edges. But it, it doesn't matter what I say. You can just get <laughs> Can I just say, being a teacher, I'm used to people listening to what I'm saying, but I am getting rubber eared here. This is hilarious. So what you're doing here is you're actually working up and down the edges of the fingers. You're almost like following the outline. You're just going for it your own wee way, aren't you? Mm-hmm. Stretching. <laughs> Even though he's not exactly following what's happening, it still feels really nice. How do you find it? Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be doing all the different things. <laughs> so you wouldn't be doing all the different things, which basically means you wouldn't be following the video. Oh, well, I kind of am. <laughs> not really. I kind of am, but not really. But listen, if you get the end result, which is the person finds it relaxing, everyone's a winner. Right, so that's us. It looks, according to the video, it looks as if we're finished doing the hand massage, here comes the stick. You ready? Mm -hmm. Now we've caught up and we're a bit early. Mm -hmm. Oh no, we're doing more stretching. Mm -hmm. Oops, that was my knuckles. Did anyone hear that? Crunch. <laughs> He's literally, don't twist my fingers the wrong way. <laughs> more stretchy. This feels so nice though. And this is the hand where I did a YouTube short recently and I've got a little bit of dermatitis on two fingers, not even the full finger, just near the nails. And I have no idea what's causing that dermatitis. I don't actually know. I don't think it's an irritation. I think it might actually be um, just one of those things, either the change of season or autoimmune, you know what it's like now. Mm -hmm. And I, oh, there we go. Here's the stick. And, uh, this won't do any harm for that dermatitis. <laughs> I'm just laughing. Cause you're <laughs> now, you're meant to hold it like a pen. That's better. Right, so, bearing in mind that we've turned me on to silent for this, so we don't even know what I'm saying. 
I never looked at the video. No. <laughs> I think what we're gauging from this is Alan doesn't listen to me anyway, so it doesn't matter. Right, so we're doing press and release. <laughs> just, just where you feel like it. <laughs> Still feels nice. And then you're doing little, sort of almost like pressing in and wiggling. And then release, and then wiggle and release. But a lot of the time you're maybe following a method. <laughs> You're doing join the dots, aren't you? Mm -hmm. That's funny. How does it feel to use those? Does it feel comfortable or odd? Um, well, poking somebody in a stick was a, was a bit <laughs> odd, but I mean, yeah, I mean. Now you're working just up and down the fingers. I would say up and down. <laughs> that's, that is relaxing. A little bit ticklish, but it's relaxing. So that's more of like a colouring in type move. Is that how you used to colour in? Uh, I was always <laughs> bad at colouring in. But it feels nice. It does feel relaxing. I can't deny that. I think what we're gauging from this is you can pretty much use the stick however you want. I mean, let's be honest. People on YouTube massage with knives and forks and wooden spoons. Alan did say earlier, do you think if we did a wee reference to Phoebe and Friends with a couple of wooden spoons, do you think folk would get it? And I actually think a lot of you would get it immediately that that is a reference to Phoebe's massage. So if in the future I do a little massage with some wooden spoons, you'll know. So again, it does feel very, very relaxing. We're not really following the video. But I can we're honestly, sort of. we're sort of, we're following it. It's upside down. It's the wrong oh, no. hand as well. <laughs> what I would say was it's an ode, or um, what's a nice way of putting it? It's a, a tribute to mm. the original video. Yeah. <laughs> a reimagining. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is a bit like when Alan's cooking something and he wants me to help, but he doesn't want me to help. Oh, that feels nice. That's me talking about cooking. This is like the rolling pin. I can feel the crunching and the cracking, but it feels so nice. I think we're pretty much done. Mm -hmm. You just sort of stretch it all out to finish. Yeah, this is you kind of coming to the end of it now. Mm -hmm. So even though we didn't really follow the video much... We sort of did. <laughs> How would you rate using a massage stick? I mean, it's easy to use, but poking someone with a stick is a bit weird. <laughs> I'm not going to lie to you. But did you find it comfortable? Yeah, it's easy. It's, yeah, it's easy to use, but I'm just poking <laughs> hands with a stick. <laughs> no idea. And I didn't look at the video before. No, but that's half the fun, is just seeing if you can follow it. But then mm. they're seeing if you can follow it and choosing not to follow it. That's too... <laughs> yeah, and I'm kind of lazy when it comes No, to you like to do your own thing. Um, an independent thinker? Not my cup of tea. No, what? Massaging or? Massaging. No, oh, well, really. well, thanks for coming on the channel. <laughs> 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 now, does everyone understand? I, I don't get massages. Mm, I'm more of a behind the scenes person. Yeah, behind the scenes. But um, that'll do. That's been, for someone that's not really a massager, that's been very helpful, very nice. And you've done, <laughs> tap, tap, you're done. Yeah. But thank you very much. That does feel very relaxing. Mm -hmm. And um, there's my little area. I don't know if you can see it. A little bit of dermatitis there and there. But I did a short because the um, Aveno Dermexa Baby Oat Complex Emollient has really helped it. Not taking it away completely, but it's helped. So if you've got any suggestions or you've tried that, let me know. But um, if you want Alan to do more, I'm sure he will. He might moan about it, but he will. Mm -hmm. So thanks, Alan. I appreciate that. No worries. <laughs> <laughs> Have a great day and I'll see you again soon.